Hey everybody, this is Brad from Johnson Small Engines, the one-handed mechanic. If I can do it, you can too. We have a LA-105 today, John Deere. I just want to show you how to take the mower deck off. And as you saw in the thumbnail, you only need a pair of pliers to take off the mower deck. All right, and I'm going to use a piece of cardboard for my knees. I would definitely suggest getting somewhere on flat level service if you can. If you have asphalt or concrete, that's a great way to be able to slide the mower deck out and uh, get it out easy. Uh, we're on asphalt, so first thing you want to do is put the mower deck all the way in down position as far as it'll go. Next thing you want to do is probably take off the mower deck belt itself from the front engine pulley, which is under here. And this has a nice, now if you don't have these on your machine and or one's broken, make sure you, you, uh, you put another one of these in here. I know a lot of people through the years, these things fall off and they wonder why their mower deck belt falls off. Well, this keeps the mower deck belt on. So take the mower deck belt off here, Take it off. Now, also the other side has a hook on it, so I'm going to do it just from this side and take it off. So that's off. Since we're in the front here, we might as well take off this. It's a, I call this a uh, butterfly or bow tie clip. These are really nice clips. Um, they're a little tricky sometimes to get off, but they do come off. And sometimes you have to pull in. If you pull it in on the rod here and pull it towards you, it actually will give you some room here to work. They're not pinched, and you should be able to just by hand at that point. comes right off. This one has a washer here that you want to make sure you don't lose. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to hold up on the mower deck a little bit. So this will come out easily because there's tension on it. And then wash your fingers when you put it down. You want to take this out, in my opinion. If you take it out of the front of the hole here where the bracket is, you won't have any chance of bending this rod so take it out when you're not working on it and just by this video and also seeing the wear mark you'll know which way that this goes back in all right so you know that it goes back like that and not the other way i'm going to put this out on the rest put rest here we're going to go to the back arm here which has to come down but before we do that we're actually going to take off the cable adjust just the adjustment cable actually it's not adjustment cable this is actually the pto cable that you have to take off and there's a pin here and these pins can be a little tricky too to get off and pull this guy out like that and then you can pull this right out up and it comes out of its holster and then you have to go underneath the belt here underneath this bracket this bar here is the blade break you want to make sure when you put this back underneath that it goes underneath all this and then right here there's a little hook on the spring now if you go 90 degrees with this you can you can get this off so you're going to Come over here like this, 90 degrees like that, and it'll come right out. Take this out, put it somewhere where it won't get wrapped up underneath the wheels. I usually put like a little bungee on these and wrap it around here because these will come off and then get wrapped up underneath your wheels when you're driving without the mower deck on. Okay, we have two guys here we have to take off. This is the one arm that holds the mower deck up, and as you can see here, you just pull this pin forward. Make sure these pins go back in this way, because if you're driving forward, they're, they're usually not going to pop out that way. Um, backing up, we don't do a whole lot of, but if you have these, I'm going to pull it out. If you have them like this, and you're driving forward, it can actually pop out if you hit something, and then you'll lose them, and your deck will fall down, and then you have bad cutting. So just make sure you put them back in that way. That's just my opinion. As you can see, this looked like it had a washer at one point, and this guy has lost all his washers. Um, I put him back without the washer, but technically there should be a washer here. Um, but obviously it's been running like this for a long time. Um, you're just gonna hold up the motor deck again a little bit up and then take this off, put it down. Don't lose your clip. The other guy here, now this is a real heavy duty uh, clevis pin there. And these guys normally don't come out, um, normally don't pop off, but take that off. There's a washer here. Make sure you don't lose the washer. And then again, you pick up the mower deck just a little bit if there's any, see there's tension on this. So if you pick up the mower deck, it takes the tension right off. Turn this 90, it comes out from the hole here. It's supposed to. Okay, these guys get worn too right here. These aluminum guys will get worn, but they go in here and they only go one way. All right, so you put them in like this and you twist it. And you make sure this, this bar here is facing the rear. Okay, that's how they're from the factory, that's how they are, so you put them back that way. And you should take that one out. Go around to the other side. I'm gonna do the same thing on the other side. And we'll start with the big guy back here, I guess. Pull that guy up. Sometimes turning it sideways and then pushing it up will help it come out easier. I'm also gonna lift up the mower deck, pop this off with the washer. And actually I did it, washers in my hand, all the clips are in my hand. And then 
turn this thing 90, should pop right out. And then you have this guy here. Take that pin out, pop that bar down. And at this point, I'm gonna put the mower deck handle up, but you really don't have to on this one because we took the bars off, but just, uh, it takes the bars out of the way. If you left the bars hanging, it'll bring them up out of the way. And then I normally will pull the mower deck out from the chute side. So you just slide it out. And that's pretty much how you remove the 42 inch edge mower deck on an LA-105. If everybody liked this video, please give it a thumbs up. Please subscribe, share with your friends, and I do appreciate everybody watching.